Hello, my name is Madison Crawford, and this is my presentation on insect collection, specifically the honeybees. Introduction. Insect collection is important in order to have a better understanding of the insects around us. By collecting and cataloging these species, researchers can discover information about the key roles insects play in our environment. Schaff states the study of insects and their relatives is of increasing importance as society faces increased challenges to preserve and enhance environmental quality. The purpose of this research is to observe honeybees in South Texas, learn about environmental changes, anatomy changes, and habitat changes in honeybees, and create a guide to help protect honeybees from extinction. What is insect collecting and cataloging? Insect collecting refers to the collection of insects for scientific purposes. Insect cataloging serves as a reference for identification in insects, therefore helps provide information on the, challenge, on the changes in the same species. The collection of the insect species Apis mellifera will help determine environmental changes in Laredo and if the Apis species has adapted to those changes. The photo on the right is the collection boxes located at Laredo College that hopefully hold honeybees located in previous years. What are honeybees and what is their role? The scientific name for honeybees is Apis mellifera. Honeybees are flying insects that live on nectar and pollen. Without honeybees, pollination would be difficult and time consuming. The Royal Society Publishing best describes the honeybee's role as a highly valued pollination service for a wide variety of agricultural crops and ranks as the most frequent single species per pollinator for crops worldwide. The photo on the right shows a comparison of size between the queen bee and the working bees. Research questions. What is the difference between the honeybees that were collected 50 years ago to the ones collected today? Is there a decrease or an increase in bee population? And what are the contributing factors affecting bee population? Methods and materials. This research consists of organizing and cataloging of Apis mellifera. The different locations to gather data will be Laredo College. However, if Laredo College is not open in the fall, then the data that will be gathered will be in pub public or private areas, such as parks or back and front yards. The materials used to collect data are kill jars, nets, insect traps, insect boxes, pins, labels, and field guides. The photo on the right is an example of the way insects are labeled and pinned in boxes. The expected changes in the honeybee's habitat is negative due to the changing climate. And there are no expected changes in the honeybee's appearance compared to the honeybees collected in previous years. There is expected decline in the honeybee population in South Texas due to the changing climate and habitat. Conclusion. To conclude, the purpose of this research is to distinguish whether there has been environmental impact on the honeybees in comparison to the environment in South Texas in previous years. The findings from this research will help give a better understanding on how to safely collect and catalog the insect species Apis mellifera. Additionally, this research will provide information on the preservation and importance of the Apis mellifera. These are my references for the research. Acknowledgements. I would like to thank Dr. Nora Garza, Vice President for Research Development and External Affairs, Ms. Rosemary Aguedal, LEAF's Project Director, Ms. Juliana Kelly, Faculty Mentor, and, Gabrie and Ms. Gabriela Solis, Undergraduate Research Coordinator. Thank you.